darlings, this is Christina at Makeup Box FYI, and I hope you're having a wonderful day. Today, I'm going to be talking about how to make your actual lashes look like false lashes. We all know that mascara is the finisher of all the work that you've done. It is the cherry on top of the whipped cream of the delicious Sunday that is your face. So I found that these two products worked excellent together. Um, you may have something different that you currently love in mascara. Masks are very personal in how we enjoy them. And so what I love, you may not, but these are the ones personally that have worked very well for me. Excuse me through this video if my voice goes in and out. I am getting over the stupidest, nastiest cold oh, I've had for almost two weeks. So my voice is still going in and out. However, anyways, I wanted to debut that with you. Also, if you're new to my channel, welcome. And if you are um, one of my subscribers, thank you for tuning in and subscribing. I have so many fun new things that I want to talk about, that I want to do concepts for, and I'd love for you to come on this journey. So if you haven't, if you like what you see, like and subscribe if you wouldn't mind to help me. So without further ado, let's get into it. So I'm gonna bring you guys in a little closer so I can show you the demo. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna use is the Dior Show Ionic Over Curl Mascara, and it's in the color 90. And this is the wand. So it, as you can see, it is a beautiful curl. It just kind of naturally just will glide onto your lashes so wonderfully. Now, I have naturally curly lashes, so if you do not, you may want to use an eyelash curler before any of these steps. Make that your first step. Okay, so I'm going to just wipe off the excess, and what I will do, I start underneath with this particular mascara. So I start underneath. I just kind of curl it up and then I go underneath the root wiggle 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 so already you can see the difference so I typically will keep doing this process until my lashes will hit above my my eyelid space. So I'm gonna show you. So I'm gonna keep going. And you can just keep layering. This is why I love these two products without it getting clumpy. So now you can see it's above my eyelid space so I feel good about where this is going. Now this one I actually use for my under eyelash as well. So I will do that. It's so great because it's the bristles are so small and curled that it just hugs even the smallest little lashes and I do have small little lashes underneath. So do you see how much more open my eye looks? So I love mascara. Even if you don't have eyeshadow, mascara, running out of the house makes a huge difference. That's why a lot of people like falsies is because it gives you a beautiful makeup look all the time. There's something about beautiful lashes that just makes you automatically look more put together and a little more feminine. So now we're gonna go in with my classic Chanel Le Volume. Look, Chanel's had a lot of different mascaras, but this is still the one I love. Um, I just do. I just always come back to it. And as you can see, the bristles, it's different. So this actually has, helps add to the fullness versus like bringing out the curl and stuff. So I do the same thing. I go underneath. And this is in the color, I believe it's 100. Oh, sorry, in the color 10. Okay. 
Okay, so you can see the difference between the eyes. So it makes all the difference in the world, mascara. And as you can see, they look super like butterfly-like and it just enhances my actual eyeshadow. By the way, everything I wear, I always list below. They're non-affiliated links, so feel free to peruse um, my face products. So yeah, I love it. Okay, so I'm gonna do the other eye and I'll be right back. All right, darling, so this is the completed look. And as you can see, it just finishes the look and they do look so long, so natural, cause they are. And honestly, these two mascaras, I wanna say are like $40 each, maybe a little more, but $80, these last me about two and a half months. So already you can see what a savings it is to just do your own lashes. And even with these higher end mascaras, it's still cheaper than the lash extensions or, um, you know, putting the lashes on, but that really takes a toll. Both of those take a toll on your actual eyelashes. So this is a much healthier way to preserve your lashes. So I hope this helped and I'm curious, what are your kind of favorite mascara products listed down below? I'd love to have a conversation about it, but I hope this helped. I hope you guys have a fabulous week and I will see you guys really soon. Have a great day.